Our state is looking to expand access to abortion. This comes as the Supreme Court may be ready to overturn Roe v. Wade. CBS 2's Dick Brennan is here with the latest on the battle over reproductive rights. Dick? Well, Cindy and Maurice, if Roe is overturned, New York is likely to go and see a surge of people forced to come here to get an abortion. The idea of the bill is to get money to abortion providers and to take care of people regardless of residency, income, or insurance. Every person in this nation should have the freedom to control their own body. Attorney General Tish James joined other elected officials to promote legislation that would expand access to abortion. If Roe is overturned, 26 states will ban and or are likely to ban abortion. And 58% of women of reproductive age or about 40 million women uh, live in those states. And many would be forced to come here and that could put a strain on abortion care in New York. New legislation would create a dedicated state program to provide financial resources to abortion providers and patients. People who don't have insurance, don't have access to insurance, can get this care. And it also provides resources for folks to get here, travel, Child care. A leaked draft by Justice Samuel Alito suggests the Supreme Court is ready to overturn Roe v. Wade, the ruling that legalized abortion nationwide. After a weekend filled with protest, including outside the homes of some justices, the Senate is getting ready to vote on an abortion rights bill, but it's unlikely that it will have the votes to pass. The abortion debate will not go away in the country. It will be decided by the people, not a handful of judges. In a weekend interview with USA Today, Senate Republican leader Mitch McConnell said it's possible legislators could see a nationwide ban on abortion if the court overturns Roe and if Republicans win control of Congress, something Democrats say cannot be allowed to happen. We are about to go to a perverse handmaiden's tale reality where we have a nation that a woman who is a survivor of sexual violence will be told just hours after her attacker finishes their violence that they have to bring a pregnancy to term. The vote on the abortion rights bill in the Senate will come Wednesday. Democrats want to force Republicans to vote because it will force them onto the record on an issue that could be very divisive to those facing re-election. In the newsroom, Dick Brennan, CBS 2 News. Dick, thank you.